Bob Mortimer, which team do you support? I support Middlesbrough. Who are your footballing heroes? My footballing heroes are Janino and Graham Saunas. Saunas? Saunas, yeah. Have I said that wrong? Depends who you ask. In Middlesbrough, he's Saunas. And you can take any other um, pronunciation and stick it. What's the best chant you've ever heard? Best chant? I always, uh, the, it, it doesn't, uh, the best chant is Man City. The first time I saw the Man City fans, I was in the Man City fans for some reason, singing the Blue Nose Crew, but they actually did have blue noses. And I enjoyed that, because it was a long time ago before that sort of thing had come into the game. Who's the dirtiest player you've ever seen? Um, Terry Yorath. Filthy Terry Yorath. What was the first game you went to? The first game was Italy versus North Korea in the World Cup 1966, Erson Park. If you could put two players together in a boxing ring, who would they be? Um, Crouchy, he's got the reach, and I'd put him in with a nice little tiddler. I'm thinking of that Burnley lad, who was that Burnley player? So I, uh, Brian Flynn. I'll, I'll take Brian Flynn v Peter Crouch, please, if I may have tickets, I'd be very grateful. What's your favourite cliché? Football-wise, I didn't see it. What's the best goal you've ever seen? Best goal? Beckham's uh, free kick against Greece, just because of the emotion surrounding it. They're probably technically better goals, but wow. Awesome. What position do you play? I play right wing. Nippy? Too right, used to be. Tricky. Tricky as well, yeah. Combine that, do you know what I mean? You're talking messy. What's your favourite England game or performance? Um, my favourite game is the England versus Cameroon in the 82 World Cup. No, in the 80... That'll be 80... 90. 90, that's 90 in Italy. Um, I was at that game and it was um, extraordinary and emotional roller coaster, fabulous game. Is watching the game on the telly a problem in your house? Watching um, the sixth match of the week becomes a problem. Up until then, uh, it's sweet. Which footballing figure would you most like to go to the pub with? Andy Gray. Off the top of my head. That'll be fun. I bet he spills the beans. I bet he's a bit of a, you know what I mean, put a few in him. 